Hi, Nancy. Can you hear me? Hi, Disha. I can hear you. Hi, Nancy. Can you hear me? Yes, Disha. I can hear you. Okay. Good, 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 good. How are you, Nancy? Great, Disha. And you? How are you? I'm good. I'm good. Can't complain. Welcome, Glenda. How are you? Good evening, teacher. Very well, thank you. What about you? I'm good. I'm 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 good. Happy. Okay. Um, yeah. I'm glad to good. hear that. Thank you. Thank you. All right. You're welcome. <laughs> and how about Leticia? How are you, Leticia? Good evening, teacher. All good, thanks. And how was your work day? Oh well, my work day um, was good. Can't complain. It was, it was, it was a, a a good day. Yesterday was a little bit stressful, but today was a good day. So I'm I'm happy. I can't I can't complain. <laughs> okay, teacher. Yeah. All right. And welcome, Esther. Esther, are you there? Yes, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Esther. How are you? I'm fine. And you, teacher? I'm good. Not bad. Yeah, I was um, just um, saying that, you know, today was a it was a it was a relaxing day. It wasn't too too bad. Um, yesterday was a bit, it was a bit of a difficult day, but but today is, was pretty good. So yeah, <laughs> so I'm pretty I'm happy I'm happy. What about the rest of you? How are you? Josebet, how are you? And Sarayi, how are you? I am fine, teacher. Thanks. Good, good. I'm happy to hear that, Sarayi. What about Josebet? How are you? Good evening, teacher. I'm fine. Thank you. And you? I'm good. I'm good. Um, I'm happy. Um, pretty good. Yeah. Um, yeah. All right, guys. Uh, or better said, girls, because I don't have any guys. Oh, there he is. There's the first guy. <laughs> Never mind. I was going to say I don't have any guys in my class right now, but apparently I do. I, I have, I only, I have my one guy. Um, hello, Maximiliano. Hello. Good evening, teacher. Good to see you. Thank you. Good to see you as well, Maximiliano. I was just telling them that um, right now is a it was an all girls class, but then you came, so um, you saved. You are the representative for the boys. Okay, teacher. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Um, well, I'm glad to I'm glad to see everybody today. Um, or and um, before before we start um, i wanted to ask you if um, you have any questions um, about um, the the exercises that i sent you uh, this morning do you have any questions any problems that arose Um, I have a problem with the second link that you sent out because I couldn't see my score. Yeah, um, that's what I, I, somebody was telling me. I didn't know that. Um, they were telling me that they had problems getting the score. I don't know why, to be honest. Uh, but I can tell you the answers um, if that, that helps. 
okay so what we can do I know that you for the second link apparently you weren't able to um, to to do it or better said to yeah you were able to do it but you weren't able to get the score so what I can do is um, go over the answers with you does is that okay yes please okay okay um so what we'll do i'll just i'm going to um just give me a moment i'm going to um go one by one um so we'll see um okay so the so all you have to do is put um, will or be going to right and of course the be going to has to be in the correct form so the first one says we don't have any bread I know I blank get some from the shop notice that the key word here is I know because the second one is the same the exact same thing but in the second one it says really so there is a difference there in between the first and the second one there's a difference and the difference is in the first one it says I know the person is con is aware of it and in the second one the person it's the first time they hear it okay so question for number one what would be the answer I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm going to. I'm okay. going to. That's right. Exactly. Um, so I'm going to put. I'm. I'm actually going to write the answers on the on the chat so that everybody knows what it what it is. Okay. So number one would be um, be going, going to. Going right? to. And because going it's to. I, because it's I, it would either be. I am or apostrophe M going to. Now, who can tell me why the answer is going to? Because he already know that he didn't, uh, they didn't have bread. Right, he already knew that they didn't have bread so what did he do if he already knew what did he do uh -huh. what did he do since he already knew what did he do he planned to buy some bread exactly he planned it he made a decision before they to, make, to buy the bread. They Does decided. that make sense? Yes. Okay, good. All right, perfect. So that one's clear. Well, the next one, no, oh, hold on. I'm going to, so this is, I'm going to get, right? I'm just going to put it. Well, the answer is just I'm going to. Okay, number two. Number two, it says, we don't have any bread. Answer, really? I blank get some from the shop then. So what would be the answer? Well, I'm going to get some from the shop then. It's the same for me. I'm going to get some from the shop then because they I decided. Okay, yes, they decided, no. but when did they decide? Was it a plan? At the moment, decide. In the moment, right? Exactly. They decided that in that particular moment. They did not make plans ahead of time. The person decided in that 
particular moment. So there was no planning, okay? So anytime that there is no plans, you use will, okay? If there is a plan, then you use be going to. Is that clear? Oh, yes. All right, welcome rest of the class. Uh, the people that just joined us, welcome. What we're doing is we're reviewing the answers from the exercises I sent you. Um, some people are telling me that uh, the the worksheet that I like I, I sent you to, um, and in the second one, they that you were not able to get the score. So we're ch we're checking the answers as a class. Okay, it's all together right now. And what we saw is that number one, for number one, it has to be be going to because since the person knew that there was no bread, they made plans ahead of time to make to no go to the Milena. supermarket or shop. Okay. Now, uh, for number two, the answer would have to be. I think uh, what well, I am. Um, I think it's be going to. Did the person make make a, a plan or did they decide in that moment? Decided in the moment. You say it in, the, in this case, use play. The people are decided in this moment. We use will. We don't plan it for the future. That's it, teacher. That's it, Maximiliano. Exactly. That's exactly yeah. it. If mm -hmm. the person does not have a plan ahead of time, okay, if they didn't plan it in the past, then we're gonna be using will. If the person had to make some plans, the person is going to be using, be going to, okay? Is that clear for everybody? Yes, teacher. Okay, good. So now, what we're gonna do is then tell me the answer. What's the answer for number two? I will get some from with the chocolate. Okay, so the answer is will, right? Okay, or if it's contracted, it would be I'll, right? Okay, so that's the answer for number two. Okay, so I'm, I'm writing the answers in the chat just so that everybody understands uh, perfectly the answer. Okay, number three now. Let's look at number three. In number three, it says, um, why do you need, oh, oh, hold on, wait, before, before we're going to, we go on to number three, yesterday I told you pay attention to key words. Okay, pay attention to keywords that will let you know what's going on in the whole context, right? So um, pay attention to those words that are going to tell you like, um, oh, this is a plan or this is some a surprise, something that you have to, you, you make the decision in the moment, okay? So in the case of number one, the, the key word there is, I know, I know. So the person already knew before, and they cr they made a plan based on what they knew. And in number two, it says, really? I said, really? So it's like surprise, <gasps> really? You know, so the person did not have a chance to plan, okay? So those are the key words in number one and number two. Number one, I know. And number two, really? So those words are going to help us to identify what's the best word to use so pay attention to key words okay all right let's continue with number three why do you need to borrow my suitcase i'm going to i'm going to i'm going to It says, I, 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 so I blank visit my, my mother in Scotland. Now, if the person has a suitcase, 
It's not because they made the decision in that moment, or they're still not sure about it. The person knows, and they made a plan for it. So since they made a plan, since the person is sure about it, then we're going to be using... Will. Will. I will visit my mother in Oskola next month. Okay, notice it says, why do you need to borrow my suitcase? The person has made plans. It's not something that the person decided in that moment or they're not really sure about. No, the person knows for sure that they're going, or better said, they, they're like maybe an 80, 90% sure that that's what's going to happen. Okay, because you know they're even borrowing a suitcase, or they're they 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 already made plans for it. So if there are plans, what structure do we use? Going to because they are plan to Be visit mother next month. They are thinking about plan. Exactly, Maximiliano. Don't forget that if the person has made plans, you use be going to. And if the person is not sure, or they made the decision in that moment that did not involve plans, then we use will, okay? Okay, did you? Teacher. So far, so good? Any questions? Okay, good. All right, so I'm going to write down the answer for number three. What is the answer? Be going to. Right, I'm but because, because it says I, what is the answer? I am going to. Exactly, I am going to, or apostrophe am going to, right? Apostrophe am going to. Okay, so there you go. Number four now, let's talk about number four. I'm really cold. What's the answer? Will. I will. I will. I will, teacher. Will. Correct, will, or apostrophe um, LL. Question, why? Why is it will? Because it's our decision in the moment. In the moment, yeah. Exactly. There was no plans involved, right? Instead, the person decided in that moment because the because it says I'm cold. So when when the person says I'm cold, you, there's a natural reaction to try to find a solution to the problem in that moment. But there's no planning ahead of time. Okay. So far, so good? Teacher, yes. in the work, in situations that are very spontaneous, we use will. That's right. If it's a spontaneous decision, there is no planning involved, you're going to be using will. That's correct. So far, so good? Yes, it's a... Perfect, okay. All right, so um, let's go on to the next one. Um, the next one is number four. It says, I'm really cold. 
Oh, no, sorry, number five. Sorry, we're number five. Are you going to John's party tonight? Answer, yes. Are you going to? Are you going to give to you a lift? Exactly. Going to be going to? Me too. Going to? I'm going to. I will. I will. I will give you, will give you a, a lift. A lift. Yeah, the best one would be, I will give you a lift, or apostrophe, L I'll give you a lift. And now, what, why? Who can explain why that's the best answer? It's, it's very nice. Because it's a decision. For no, it's decision. It's a... For no it uh, plans for uh, future is a decision. Yeah, the decision was okay. Basically, in other words, you don't plan to give someone a ride. It says, "Yes, are you going to?" I. I will give you a lift. In other words, you know, if you're going to, if you would say in this moment that you're going to. I will offer to give you the li to, to give you a lift. So the decision I take it in that moment, depending on what you you tell me, depending on your answer. Does that make sense? Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay. Good. 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 All right. So I'm going to write that down. Um, oh, wait a sec. I did already. Yeah. Okay, I already did. All right, number six. What are your plans after you leave university? What are the plans? I am going to. I am going to. I going to work in a hospital in Africa. Africa. In Africa. I'm going to. Live on the twenty-eighth. On the twenty-eighth. I am going to. I I am going to. Good, okay, and I'm sending you right now the answer. I am going to, or I'm going to. And the answer is very, very straightforward. If you notice is what are your plans? Right there, that's, that's, that's the key word there. Plans, what are your plans? So they're telling you ahead of, they're already telling you there's a plan. So and when there's a plan, you use be going to, okay? It's clear, teacher. Okay, wonderful. And um, let me see, let me see. Um, all right, number seven now. Uh, it says in parentheses, the phone rings. And the answer is, I will. I will. I will. I will. I will get it. Will. Will. Will get it. Perfect. Now tell me why. What's why is Will the correct answer? Yes, at the moment. Nobody knows when the phone rings, and it's a decision. It's the moment. Exactly. The phone rings in that moment. You decide in that moment. You there's no planning. Like you said, you can't know when the, the phone will ring unless someone tells you, I'm call I'm going to call you at this time, right? And then that, you really wouldn't know. So you decide in that moment that you hear the, the phone ringing, okay? All right, good. Number eight, it says, um, are you ready to order? I can't decide. Okay, I? I will. Will. I will have it. I'm going to. Will. I will. Will. Okay, so the majority of you say will, and I've actually got to agree with you. It's will. Now, who can tell me why? Because it's in thing. Is that a decision in the moment? I can't decide. Because the people 
are decided in the moment have a state, not thinking about I have stayed uh, in the noon or, or next week. He gonna say the mistake, the state uh, at the moment. Yeah, notice it says here, um, I can't decide. It says, okay, so the person's looking at it, I can't decide. Mm, okay, and then all of a sudden the person says, okay. So in that moment, the moment they say, okay, that moment they decide. They have not planned. They have not planned what they're going to eat. It's different than when you go, for example, you go to a restaurant, you say, I want to go to this particular restaurant because I want to eat this food, right? Uh, I want to go to this restaurant because I'm, I'm craving to eat this food. In that case, you plan uh, ahead of time. But in this case, there is no planning. Does that make sense? That makes sense. Yes. Yeah. Just to check. Okay, good. So that's number eight. Um, okay. Um, all right, number nine. Let's go for number nine. And just give me a second that I lost it. Give me one, one second. I just lost it. Okay, got it. Okay, so uh, number eight, number nine says, are you busy tonight? Would you like to have some coffee? Or would you like to have coffee? Sorry, I am going to, or I will go to the library. I, Which one? I am going to. I'm going to. I'm going to go to, to, to the library. Correct. It's going to be I am going to or I'm going to. Now, who can tell me why? Because the person has the plan. Yeah, exactly. The answer is right there. It says, I've been planning. The person already told you that's a plan. So, of course, it's going to be be going to. Okay, and the last one. Why are you carrying a hammer? I am I going to. I am going to. Got some pictures. I am going to put up I'm some going pictures. to put up some pictures. <laughs> I'm going to. Very good. I'm going to, or, sorry, I am going to, or I'm going to, whichever one you want, okay? And the reason is very simple. Again, if you person is have, if the person is carrying a hammer, they have already decided well, something, right? They're not like saying, mm, I don't know, should I do it or not? should I not do it? Let me see, what I, what can I do? No, the person has already decided because they have the hammer in their hands. Okay, so they've already taken action. So that indicates that it's a plan and not a decision in that moment. Does that make sense? Yes, it can make sense. Yes, you sure. Okay, perfect. And um, so, oh, sorry, I forgot to put number 10, but the last answer that I wrote there is number 10. So there are your answers. So for the people that, um, the people that are, that, um, are wondering what, what score they got, well, the, there are 10, there are 10 um, sentences. So if you got two, wrong that means you got eight right and your your score is an eight if you got you know five wrong then your then you means you got five correct so your score is a five and if you got all of them correct then your score is a ten okay any questions
No question. No question. No question, teacher. Okay, so yesterday I know that you were still, many of you were still worried about the difference between the will and the be going to, and you were still confused and you're like, I don't know, I don't get it. Like I, 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 in theory, I understand it, but in the practice, I don't understand it, I get lost. And I know many of you were feeling like that. My question is, how do you feel today? Do you feel that now you do understand the difference and you can distinguish when it's will and when it's be going to? I feel good with you. Explain. I feel good, you share. I understand better. Yeah, I believe that now I can see the difference between I'm going to and will when I have to use them. The concept Excellent. is clear now with the with the explanation. Uh, the concept the explanation. is clear. Explanation. <laughs> the concept is clear now uh, with the explanation. Thank you. Teacher. Excellent. You're welcome, Atisa. I'm happy to hear that. Okay. And, and um, I'm happy to hear that, that many of you have expressed that it's clear, but if there is somebody that it's still not clear, please tell me. Okay, no, no, se, no se me queden callados solamente porque o todos los demás dicen que es clear. <laughs> but I was like, tell me, tell me please. For me, teacher is very clear. Uh, when you began to explain in the the topic, I I had confused, it, but for today is clear. It's clear for for me. I understand very well the topic. Excellent. Okay. Good. 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 Okay. What about the others? For me, it's very clear, teacher. I, I think with the exercise today in group is very important because uh, it's an impress, it's, it's, it's listen to the opinion to the others and the arguments why will or why going to is very important. And for me, it's very clear. Thank you. You're, you're welcome, Elena, and I absolutely agree with you. Um, it's very important for me to hear your opinions to as to why you chose that answer, because it's not the same as me just telling you the answer, then you tell me it's because of this. Because when you tell me it's because of this, then I know that you do understand it. Okay. Good. Well, all right. So do we agree? Does everybody agree that we understand it, that we have no problems, we have no doubts? Yes, teacher. Yes, we agree. I mean, agree. Mm -hmm. With everyone. Yes, okay, good. Excellent. All right. In that case, guys, um, all right. So we have basically finished section five um you know and, and actually if you notice section five is is very short right it's the whole thing is just will and be going to right so if you understand this you understand all of the section now let's go on to the the final exam questions that you have for the final exam i want to check the answers with you if you're having any problems remember today is the last day Okay, so lo digo en español porque I really, really need everybody to have 100% of, you know, completion on the, on the platform. Hoy a las 12 de la medianoche se cierra la oportunidad y, y se queda usted con la nota que usted um, tiene para esa fecha eh, o para esa hora. ¿no? Entonces, eh, si usted no lo completa, 
lamento mucho, pero no va a poder continuar el próximo nivel. Entonces, por favor, eh, hagan preguntas. Ahorita todavía hay chance. Cuando ya terminemos la clase, todavía habrá tres, tres horas por las dudas, pero si quieren ahí terminarlo por X motivo, que no hayan terminado algún ejercicio. Ok. But I, right now is the moment to ask me questions about the final exam. Teacher, are you talking about the platform? I am talking about the platform, yes. Okay. The final exam in the platform. I finished uh, the last week, but I don't send the, the diploma. Is it necessary to send the diploma? Um, you need to generate, I think you need to generate the diploma, but you don't have to print it. Okay, you don't have to print it if you don't want to. Now, eh, I don't remember if it was this class or, or another one that I had that were, some people were asking me about, uh, asking about the diploma, that they said, okay, when they printed the diploma, you couldn't see everything. Um, what you can simply do if that happens to you, if you're trying to print the diploma and when you print the diploma, it doesn't, um, you can't see everything. What I suggest you do is reduce it to like um, like an 80%, 80, um, reduce it to an 80% and print it out an 80% and then you will be able to see it, okay? Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher. And if for whatever reason, even if you reduce it to 80%, you still can't see the whole thing, reduce it more, okay? Sigan reduciendo hasta que, hasta que pueda caber toda la información en, en, el, en la página. Yo lo tengo, teacher, no, pero no, no lo he mandado, no lo he enviado a nadie. O sea, esa es la, mi pregunta, me quedo, me quedo con la duda. Es, es que debo enviarlo. Debo enviarlo a, 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 a usted o, a, o ahí al a inglés corporativo. No, no the diploma. You don't need to send the diploma because they can see your, your results on the platform. So as long as you're... As long as the, the platform says the platform. 80 or more, you're fine. Yes. Okay, the you don't have to worry. So the, 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 the advance, the advance in, in the finish to the, to the exam too. Exactly. Um, let me see if I, if I can find it. I think, let me see if I can find, there was a, a picture that somebody sent. Yeah, thank you. Yes, exactly. Thank you very much. Okay, in the platform, you will be able to see, you will be able to see um, there, there are some bars the red bars, there's a red bar. Um, there are one, two, three, four, five, six. Six red bars? See that? Six red bars. Uh -huh. Okay, so we have six red bars. The first red bars are the, um, the what's it called? Um, um, the, the sections, okay? After that, you will see a dark red or brown, maybe, like, maybe it's more like a brown, like a brown bar. And the brown bar is the, um, the midterm, okay? That's the midterm. And then after that, there is a gray bar, okay? That is a gray bar. And the gray bar represents the final exam. So what you have to, and, and, and like they say in the Spanish, ojo con esto. The, the things that are more, that have a more percentage um, a rating is the final exam. And also the, the, um, the midterm is 
pretty much the same, the same um, score as all of the sections together. Okay, so in the end, the last bar represents the part of it will be in gray, which represents what you got for the final exam. The then there is a part with um, the the what the 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 midterm, with, and there's that part that makes up that score. And then at the bottom there we have the um, the red part, which represents all of the sections. Okay, so in the end the score will be based. It's the last bar. The, the your final score will be from the last bar. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah, it makes sense. Makes sense. Okay, good. All right, now you do not have to send the certificate because the certificate is for you. That is for you to have when you want it. But because Ingles por Corporativo is going to be able to see your score. So they don't need to, to have the certificate to know that you already passed to the next level or not. They don't need it. Okay, so the administration does not need it. Okay, um, so you can, you can print out the certificate whenever you want. You can do it today or you can do it in the past and tomorrow or whenever you want. Okay, any questions? Not sure. Oh, but don't keep in mind that when you print the certificate, you cannot change the score anymore. Okay, so if you if you print the certificate, um, let's say you say, oh, yeah, I finished the platform and it's like the third week of class and you finish the platform in the third week of class. And you still have one week to complete it, but you just you say, ah, I'm going to print out the certificate. You can print out the certificate, and but the score is going to be only what you what it is when you printed out the certificate. After that, if you want to continue practicing, you can continue practicing, but the score for the certificate will not change. Okay? Okay, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay, teacher. Yes, teacher. Teacher, your microphone, your microphone is off. Thank you. I just noticed that. Thank you. Um, okay. So yeah. So that that's it for um, for that information about the platform. Now, what about the exercises? Let's talk about exercises itself. Are there any exercises that you are still having problems with that you still don't understand? Well, sorry, in my case, I don't have any problem in the exercise the platform. Okay, but let me, let me do it like this. Hagamos algo más fácil. Tengo, tengo, tengo la sensación que ya terminaron, así que let me, let me, I'm going to send the, I'm going to launch the poll again. And I just want to make sure, okay, so. Check the section that you have completed already. I still have three people that have not completed the, the, the poll. So there are 13 people and only 10 have completed it. So I st I'm still missing some people. Okay, two more people need to complete it. We're still waiting for the two people. It, 
eh, ¿quién, ¿quién no ha votado aún? ¿Quién está teniendo problemas para votar? So I'm, I'm going to take it as, oh, okay, okay. So we have one person more that just voted. We're just waiting for one person more, but that's okay. We'll keep it at 12, okay? So that's, we're just gonna say that 12 people are gonna vote, okay? So I'm going to send you, I'm going to end the poll right now, and I'm going to share the results. There you go. Do you see that? Bravo! Excellent, guys. I'm really proud of you guys. Very good. Excellent. You you have done wonderful. Yes. I actually I'm gonna I'm going to do this. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Good. Wow. I'm very proud of you guys. You've worked hard, um, and um, it's paying off. You can I can tell that you um, are getting better at this. Very good. And that's how you should keep it keep it up okay don't don't you are you're in the middle basically of the of the of the course or not of the plo the diploma don't give up keep on doing it like this there are still more um there are still more more levels to go um so don't don't stop okay continue going very very good yeah everybody seems to be finished very very good okay excellent all right, guys. Um, so, in the last few minutes that we have a class, um, let's. I would like you guys um, to. I'm going to get you guys to um, work in groups, and because I, I want you guys to also have a chance to talk and everything, and I want you to think about. Since we're talking about the future, I want you to think about what's going to happen when you're finished with the English courses. When you have a diploma from Inglés Corporativo that says that you have finished the course, that you finished the diploma, or well, Inglés Corporativo and in support both. What's going what are you going to do? What are your plans? What do you want to do? What are you have you decided on doing and what you haven't decided on doing? Let's continue practicing that, okay? So, I'm going to get you to work. This time I'm going to get you to work in bigger groups. We have 14 of no, 13 of you. So, we'll get you into groups of 4 or 5. Okay? And I want you to talk about it, okay? Um, so and ask questions okay don't just limit yourself don't limit yourself to just asking certain questions like go ahead and I want you to talk 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 as much as possible okay that's my idea All right so I'm opening up the rooms right now so go ahead and join your group Okay, sir. Are you studying another career, Esther? At the university? Um, yes, I want to study medicine. Study medicine. And okay. it's very important. The yes. Other language. Yes. And more English. Yes, because the books and the other knowledge are in English and you need to learn exactly the, the language, the English language. Okay, congratulations, Esther. Thank you. And what is your plan? And 
when I finish the this course, I I will to put in practice because I work with with uh, students, and my idea is uh, to teach uh, to teach something about the language, the English language, um, and improve the the knowledge and in, improve the the practice about the about the language, the English language. This is my my uh, my uh, my idea. And you, Juan Carlos? Sorry, I was drinking water. Okay. Uh, good evening. Uh, good evening. I, I, I'm going to continue study English in Duolingo and Blackboard too. Um, I'm going to practice with my co co-worker because my work is um, the, the the language is very very important because uh, my uh, our broker only only speak English. Oh. Then then I I send mail every day uh, with with English language. And then so. I, I send I send it I send the the, the mail in, in English. In, it's very important because I I always send the mail using to translate to Google. But but now I I practice writing the mail in I it's better, it's better than I I because study doors of labor to improve my income to improve my social status and if it it um but i am looking for move to another country i don't know if it, i really want to go to england so i really want to to speak english very well to have a really good pronunciation uh, to have really good, um, like speak like a native English, but uh, I have, I think, <laughs> okay, my OGT is to improve my my social situation, I think. Okay. And now, Jose Alberto, tell me, tell us. Please, okay, Jose Alberto is not, He's not here. here. Okay. And now? <laughs> hey, Nancy, are you working right now? Tell no, me. No, no. Are you working? No, right, uh, right now I don't work because when uh, I lost my job on um, March the last year and I look for a job, but it's difficult to, to, to have a, a job in this time because the situation is so difficult. Yeah, I believe that I'm in the same situation that you. I lost my job. Yes, I had I had a great job, but I lost, and I don't know. But I sent my curriculum, my curriculum, but I don't, I don't find a job. I didn't find a job. So sad. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. And, and you, Brother Fredo, are you working? Do you have a job? I 
hobby. Pero no han avisado nada, ¿verdad? De, de, de conferencia, ni no. nada. De... No, no, no. No, no, no. Va para el lunes, ¿verdad? Quizás. No. No hay información ahora. Try to keep it in English. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Acabamos de cambiar el idioma, no, tío. No. It's, it's coincidence. Dios, no, si no, hombre, si hasta italiano sí. estamos hablando ya. French, Chinese. Inglés, italiano, francés, inglés, de todo. Y, y, ay, no. Ya está mandando. Dos segundos antes de entrar, hubiera escuchado alemán. Don't like this match. I only speak in English, but but uh, I we changed the me I changed the, the the language to Spanish because I need the more information about the platform. Okay. Um, another, okay. another participation, okay. classmate. No more. Leticia. Leticia one one question. Or... I don't. I I didn't understand. Um, you travel to USA? I repeat, no, no, no. Listen, are, in clear, it's clear. Are Are you travel to USA in next month? Or... Um. <laughs> I, I didn't understand in that. When, when um. Quiero ver Juan Carlos, ¿verdad? ¿Sí? Juan Carlos. There is no date. Uh, there is no date yet. For women. For moment. Ah, ok. But you have plans. It's a, it's a, it's, uh, it's plans. In the moment, it's plans. Ok. Wiley, you, you learn more. Well, your plan is, uh, is accomplished, you will learn more English. Yes. And English is that. It's, it's a good idea. Yes. <laughs> practice. Practice and practice. Esther, yeah, do you have the participation? No. It's Hello, Kane. We'll be back. Okay, welcome back, everybody. Um, well, guys, we have come to the end of our class and the end of our course. Um, it's been such a pleasure um, having you guys in my class. And I hope all the best for you in the future. I hope that maybe in the future we'll see each other again. But if we don't, I just hope everything, all the best for you. And, um, and I hope that uh, you will continue being as dedicated as you have been all this time. And if you do that, you will continue being very successful, okay? So um, that's it for my part and um, take care of it. Take, lots of care okay and be very safe okay so bye guys thank you teacher for everything thank you teacher thank you teacher thank you teacher thank you good nice night happy weekend good night and good dreams good night teacher good night teacher good night everybody have a good okay. weekend as well okay. you too Bye. Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.